Following the tweets of uh, Donald Clark, I found uh, objection to stories. He, he doesn't like the fact that uh, LinkedIn is promoting stories. He doesn't like storytellers. And um, unfortunately, that this was just as I decided to put him in a story and try and make the campus more interesting because uh, next week there is a a talk by Ben Williamson in Lancaster. Well, it might not be in Lancaster. It might just all all these things might be on Zoom, as far as we know. Um, but uh, let's say it was in Lancaster. If it was, it would be somewhere near where the Making Time Garden used to be, which I think of as a as a location for conversation, because. Um, I think you've got to start with with academics. If you well, if you're going to persuade them, let's let's just start with the the academics who are probably going to be there at the sort of social science humanities end of the campus, the Lancaster campus, and they probably don't start out sympathetic to ed tech, but maybe once once they start talking about it, they may think about. Um, MOOC platforms and have some sympathy with them. I mean, that that would be the first bit of storytelling, trying to get them to look at um, what MOOC platforms actually offer, what their history is, how it came about with, let's say, the Open University with FutureLearn or um, Harvard MIT with, with edX or those those sorts of things. And then continue walking along the um along the spine of the Lancaster campus and then gradually introduce things like ask the question what has been spent on the spine as architecture and how would that compare with investing in a platform and um going through the learning zone uh what's the investment been in the learning zone has it has it been useful what is the library looking like nowadays? And then gradually get to the business school and um, info lab at the other end. And um, I think at that time, start talking to them about AI and um, the ed tech scene. So it's, a, so it's, an, it's an idea of just sort of presenting things gradually. Um, but whether this makes any sense especially to Donald Clark, I'm not, I'm not quite sure. He, he might be just as happy to do a grumpy opinion uh, at an early stage. But I, I think that would make it a much shorter story. Mm, not sure what to think.